Right now, the search for the suspect in a quadruple shooting and fire that left an elderly woman dead and three others hurt ends. But there are still many unanswered questions this morning. Arlene Rojas Castillo joins us live this morning from Milwaukee's Police District 5 with what we know so far. Arlene, good morning. Good morning, Simone and Tom. That's right, we're still working to learn a lot more this morning, including what led officers to a home in the city's Williamsburg Heights neighborhood and also why they believe the suspect, 57 year old Leslie Boast, allegedly shot at these neighbors in the first place. The family of one of the victims, 82 year old Sue Mallory, confirmed Boast died by suicide as police closed in on his location Tuesday afternoon near Port Washington and Melvina. Investigators say officers heard the blast of a gun shortly after they approached that home and they quickly learned that it was the quote wanted suspect that they had been looking for. Boast is the man who was charged with several crimes, including homicide, after prosecutors say he opened fire on four people roughly two weeks ago near 22nd and Center in the city's Amani neighborhood. While Mallory's family confirmed to us that Boast was the person that died, we still have yet to hear from police to publicly confirm that death. We do know that the three other victims that were involved in that shooting are expected to recover from their injuries. So a lot to learn this morning and we're still working to learn more as the day progresses. For now, reporting live at Milwaukee Police District 5, Elaine Rojas Castillo, TMJ4 News.